This is our 1992 Subaru Sambar Mini Truck. We have a few of these. This one is probably the cleanest that we have at the moment. Uh, it's low mileage, right around 20,000 kilometers, four-wheel drive with a rear locking differential. Um, and the sandbars are my personal favorite truck. Um, if you've ever visited the lot, you'll know that I kind of favor these over any other brand, and we tend to carry the most of these. This one's a really clean example, and the benefits of the sandbar are both the cabin size. This has a larger cabin than a lot of the other trucks, such as the Suzuki's or the Daihatsu's and Honda's. Uh, it also has a rear-mounted engine, so good weight distribution. All your weight's in the front, the engine weight's in the back for off-roading. That's great. Also, it's really easy to service the engine with it being all the way in the back. Uh, it's a four-cylinder as opposed to a three from the other brands, so the four-cylinder runs a bit smoother. That extra counterbalance kind of smooths everything out. Uh, it has a little bit more power and just in general feels better. And yeah, this one is really clean on the outside, as you can see. The bed's in really good condition. There are a few little signs of wear on the tailgate there and then up against the cab here, but no rust. That's really the big thing to look out for is rust on these. And this one doesn't really show any signs of that. So yeah, only 20,000 400, almost 500 kilometers. No AC in this one. There's your little diff lock switch and your four wheel drive engage button there. Clean interior, really not a whole lot to it. Um, you get the passenger seat that does fold down. Like so, and then you've got a little bit of storage right behind that with your original Subaru toolkit, which is cool. Um, yeah, floor mats are in good shape. Leather floor mats. Go ahead and start it up. Starts right up as it should. It'll probably idle a little higher because it is cold. Take a look around at all the lights. It also has just a pretty simple AM radio in here. There's also on the outside here a little bit of damage around the fuel tank. Nothing major, just looks like it was bonked. It some point in Japan right there. But yeah, it runs super smooth. Feels good when driving. Nothing to complain about. Rows through the gears perfectly fine. And you do have, so first is right here, if you push a little harder you can go further over into extra low and then as soon as I put it in extra low the four wheel drive light comes on it automatically engages that. And that's the gear where you can use your diff lock as well if you're crawling. You can only use the diff lock in extra low. Fan blows, heat works fine, everything, it's all pretty simple but it all works great. A little cigarette lighter here if you can use a phone charger in that. The door handles in Subarus are also interesting. It's a bit of a different style. But yeah, that's pretty much it with this one. Uh, it's a 1992 Subaru Sambar, four wheel drive with diff lock. Super clean, really well maintained. We have plenty of mini trucks in stock right now, so definitely come take a look. There's a lot of options. From Hondas to rear wheel drive Subarus to another four wheel drive Subaru without diff lock and higher mileage. All kinds of stuff. So, yeah, you can find all the information about this on our website, jdmcarandmotorcycle.com. Thank you for watching.